Hi there, I'm John and I'm a Zenfolio expert. Today, I'm going to show you how to link a folder containing multiple galleries directly to a page using the link page to folder feature. Using this feature, you can quickly and easily set up links on your website that generate pages, which will display a unique web page. That web page will showcase all of the galleries contained inside of a folder of your choice. The gallery pages inside of this folder, which are then created for your website, will retain all of your chosen settings for that gallery, including design settings, access control settings, price list settings, and more. So let's get started. To start, log into your Zenfolio account, and from your dashboard, click Website on the left toolbar to head over to the Web Editor. Once you're in the Web Editor, click the orange circle with the plus icon to the right of Site Pages to add a new page. The New Page dialog box will pop up when you do that. Here. Choose Link Page to Folder, and then click the orange Add Page button. A new pop-up window will appear. In this window, you can navigate to the folder that you'd like to link to the page and click it. You can tell when you've chosen the folder because an orange radial button will appear to the left of it. In this case, I'm going to choose this top folder. To continue, click the orange Continue button. After the page is generated, you'll be taken back to the web editor, and you'll see that that new page has been created. You can rename the page however you'd like, and in my case, I'm just going to leave it as it is. You can press Enter to save that name. In the preview area here, if you scroll down a little bit, you'll see that a new page has been created, and that page is linked to the folder that you chose. So this page will display all the galleries contained inside of that folder, along with their titles, the upload dates, and a photo and video count as well. You'll also see that a new link has been generated in your website's navigation menu, which links directly to this page as well. In order to preview the gallery, you'll need to click the Preview button and navigate to the page and click on it. Once you're there, you'll see that the gallery displayed on this page retains all of the gallery settings as mentioned previously. Return to the web editor, and if you're happy with your new page, remember to click the orange Publish button in the upper right corner to publish your changes to your live website.